In this lecture, we will discuss about pulmonary circulation as part of the Cardiology for Medical Students series. The main pulmonary artery originates from the right ventricle. It divides into left pulmonary artery and right pulmonary artery, which in turn further subdivides into segmental and subsegmental branches. Respiratory gas exchange takes place at the pulmonary capillaries over the alveoli. Oxygenated blood is returned by pulmonary venous system, which drains the left atrium by four pulmonary veins, right and left, superior and inferior pulmonary veins. Pulmonary circulation is a low resistance system. Pulmonary arterial systolic pressure is about one-fifth of the systemic arterial pressure. Hence, right ventricle is a thin wall chamber in the adult compared to the left ventricle which faces the systemic circulation. In fetal circulation, right ventricle is dominant. Pulmonary vascular resistance is high prior to the functioning of the lungs. This is a pulmonary angiogram obtained by injecting contrast dye into the main pulmonary artery. Catheter, that is a small tube, was introduced into the main pulmonary artery through the right femoral vein. Pulmonary angiogram shows hypoplastic main pulmonary artery and right pulmonary artery. Upper branch of right pulmonary artery is not visible and so is the left pulmonary artery. A small stump of left pulmonary artery is visible. 